comorbidity is very important because uh, uh, the person with MS can have other diseases. And we can see that the MS population is aging, uh, thereby be, because, because we are more open to uh, diagnose uh, older people. If you, as a, the, the first MS diagnostic criteria, the Schumacher criteria, actually excluded persons who were older than 50. So after, after the, the following diagnostic criteria has been more, um, uh, more had, did not have an age restriction. Uh, so therefore, people with MS live longer, but we also diagnose older people. That means that we have other comorbidities. We know that MS patients uh, have uh, a higher risk of vascular comorbidities, psychiatric comorbidities, uh, anxiety, depression. Uh, and of course, the big question was whether they had a higher risk of cancer. With I would say no, they, they do not. But the other, the other comorbidities we have to take into consideration also because, uh, again, Denmark, it's a... It, it, it's a it's a good country to investigate these questions because we have several nationwide population based registry which can be linked together by a unique personal identification number. Therefore, we can see that the persons with MS, which kind of other diagnoses they have been, um, um, yeah, they have, they have seen a doctor for, and which kind of uh, medications they have been taking. And because uh, in Denmark, the healthcare system is publicly funded and free, therefore there is no bias on, uh, on, on, on the use of, use of the healthcare system. And there we can see that, uh, that comorbidities also affect socioeconomic uh, uh, factors like uh, uh, workability, uh, divorce, and, uh, and because of course there is having more diseases affects a person in all aspects more than or having only ms uh, but comorbidities are important in the disease modifying therapy world because uh, especially the newer uh, drugs have include a risk for several side effects therefore we have to take these comorbidities into consideration to see how the how, how the multi medication or or, or 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 using several drugs at the same time could, can work together, uh, and also we know that some comorbidities affect uh, um, the disability. Therefore, disability worsening may not be solely um, caused by MS, but it can be, for example, we know that cardiovascular or lung diseases affect the, the uh, gait function. Therefore, we, we have to, again, I would get back to the personalized medicine, look at the person with MS, with all its, with all its diseases, medication, and find the right drug and the right, right care for MS.